YouTube, man, what's up? This is CFM Week 11. You guys have been asking for the CFMs, and they're getting popping. I beat the Cowboys twice. He was sick. He Actually, he only has three losses on the year, and I'm two of them. Uh, now I'm playing the Falcons. What's crazy about the Falcons, chat, and YouTube. I'll talk to the chat, talk to the YouTube, same time. Falcons are 9-1. and one. This is the, the commissioner of the league, 9-1. Um, and one. So uh, we got to do our best job here. This is pretty much going to be for home field advantage probably throughout the playoffs. Want these games in Philly. Last year, we won the Super Bowl on the road, so my team is built. We're tried. You know, we've been through the, the trials and tribulations of the playoff run. But I still want these games here in Philly. Now, this guy is going to be another runner. Another close their eyes blind runner. He has Matthew Breda from the fantasy draft. I believe he has Jukebox. Uh, that's okay. We have Roquan Smith. We have Miles Jack. We have TJ Watt. We have Daniil Hunter. This is a game while we traded for Linval Joseph. This is why we traded uh, Harrison, my safety. No, not who did I trade? Justin Simmons, my safety, for Linval Joseph for a game like this. If you're in the chat, sport on the chat, talking about Dugati. Dugati Bugs just won the Atlanta Falcons Club Series. Um, he, we're not going to talk. I, I will tell you this, and we're going to talk about it more on the podcast. And uh, Bugs is 1,000% the luckiest player of all time. I think at this point it's not even, it's not even, it, it cannot even be discussed that anybody else is in that discussion. Like, like nobody else is even close to uh, Bugs when it comes to the luckiest player of all time. All right, let's go. Everything's set up. We had, like I said, we want to see some quarterback blasts here today. Oh yeah, Spoto, you already know. Bugs is Disney. Now, nah, Bugs is this is new alter ego. Like I don't really want to talk about it because this video right here is for the CFM. Now, the podcast, you guys, if you guys that watch CFM don't watch the podcast, it's your best way to kind of get hit on what's going on in competitive Madden. You know, if you don't know who these guys are, you don't know uh, what's going on, it's your best way to get hit. So if you haven't watched any of those episodes, hit those videos below. You know what I'm saying? A lot of people here to see Big Strap. You know what I'm saying? We're going to see that strap laying around the field today, boys. I'll tell you that. Still undefeated. We 10-0. Uh, <sighs> love seeing this defense out the gate. It's not going to have a chance. Love the blitz all types, man. Might get a do rag for the playoffs, man. Might do it to myself. Like I said, you're not just gonna blitz everybody. Ah, come on, Julio. You got to get some wheels here, kid. I did not lose yet. I have not lost yet. I mean, you still every play blitzing, huh? Like, God damn, dude. Like, like <laughs> kids are brain dead on defense in Madden 20, huh? This is Madden 20, boys. This is Madden. This is Madden 20. Brain dead defense, dude. I think this is the one where he's he, he empties out the backfield. Oh, come on. That's Derwin James. Damn, that's a big stop right there, man. Just really didn't think he would literally blitz seven people every single play. Every single play. Get down there, it gets a little tougher, easier for deep blues to cover the whole field. 
Uh, that one play I ran was bad. I thought he played a little bit. That first play, I just got to keep Max protecting. He doesn't have a clue. I could have held that ball a little bit longer and got a touchdown there. And I'll tell you what, I'm about to get some gaming glasses. This is a look. This swag chat. YouTube, let me know. Swag, yay or nay on the Eagles right now. Um, we got Christian Wilkins, Marcus Hunt. We'll stay there. Single back. It's just going to, this is just going to be a absolute sweat fest on defense. This is just like it's th like I don't mind when the run works. Like last game, you guys watched the run was working when I wasn't there on defense. The one thing that sucks about this game is that the run works when you like really try to stop it. Oh, look, he just ran. A he went to a screen right there. Like, at what point did you think that was going to work? God bless his heart, boys. God bless it. Gator Bay, what's up, man? Punt the ball. That's what I like to see, boys. That's what we like to see. Watch all the clubs. We're gonna talk about them more on the podcast. On what day is the podcast? Tuesday. Today is Friday night. What's what everybody doing tonight? Let me know what you guys are up to tonight. I mean, this is just brain dead defense. I got Jim Brown already, chat. Let you guys know. And then YouTube, let me know. Do you have any of the new running backs? The, I, I'm going to be real. The promo is kind of boring to me. The, this is what the promo is. Spend 100 bucks, buy the bundle, get a running back. Literally, you get 25 of those cards to get the running back if you buy the bundle. It's got, like it's no really it's no real now this is what's going to be cool about I think the promo is cool though like the cards are awesome like don't get me wrong with that like the cards are really good like I have no problem with the actual cards you know I 
I mean, I don't want to just keep running the same play. And you guys say I run the same play. This man has ran the same defense every play, chat. Like, so how can how can YouTube community, how can Twitch community, how can people that watch Madden be mad at me, the offensive player? Well, all right, okay, he's finally in a new defense. The first play of the drive where he's in a new defense. So now we can open up the playbook a little bit. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, that's what I mean. And the minute... And this is what's funny to you guys. The minute I try to go for a deep pass or I try to you know, go for a streak or something, I get sacked and the drive is over. So if I just want to make sure you guys, that we're all on the same page when I say these things. Now, he has Derwin James. I want to hit this seam right here to Valdez, but he has Derwin James with zoned out right now. So, I mean, I could have, but uh, I don't want to take that hit. What the fuck, man? He kind of lurked over there, so it was a little bit tougher to hit that. I just want you guys to know that, man. Like, that's what people say on, on YouTube. Actually, let me run this play. He has two two linemen right now that I'm not a fan of as far as block, as far as... Uh... <laughs> Like, yeah, as far as getting pressure. Third and one. Nah, no abilities for Big Strap yet. I'm going to run this uh, quarterback blast right here for the one yard. I'm worried about fumbling, really. Can this guy go all the way across? Golly, man, that's just bad, man. I'm kicking. Judge me if you want. This guy's a, a he's not good on offense, man. Just that's two two trips, two easy, two of the easiest trips inside the ten yard line, and I can go away with no points. You know, that's that's rough. Because now, no matter what you do, you're still in a game. Like, this guy, is, all he's going to do is run and pray. But if I if I had 14 right now, you could turn the YouTube video off. Like, if, if I had 14 right now, you could pretty much kiss the baby, put this thing away. But because I don't have 14, now we're in a dog fight, you know? But it's okay. That's what I'm built for, dog fights. There you go, baby. Roquan. Where'd you come from, Roquan? That's why we drafted you. More fast. Nothing. So just absolutely nothing, dude. Absolutely nothing. Third and fifteen. Comp every time, Alpha. You already know. Comp every time. Doesn't that one be some plays when I'm here? dot dude god damn it oh my god man every runner's bum ass one dot that they have that's it that's the one dot that every bum ass runner has that's the one dot they have running back wheel Let's go, Roquan. Touch him, man. 
loves the running back wheel, and I'm out here making super adjustments like he's just like he's just kids. I gotta make super adjustments. Man, I wish I had 14 points. I wish I had 14 points. Go, Marcus Hunt. I mean, fourth and seven. What's he going to here, chat? Yeah, I'm about to put it back on followers only, boys. Running back will. New cutting hand tomorrow? I gotta see the, I gotta see this. I have not seen the cutting hand. I would love to see. I don't know where you guys saw the cutting hand stats. Would love to see them though. Like seriously, you wanna be three four odd? Here we go, boys. I mean this guy really is it's just it's just the most brain dead defense in the world. He literally has nobody in coverage. Just get a second. It's tough to beat, especially with a skate artist it's bombs. Like with a skate artist I'd have twenty eight points right now. Oh he switched it up. Okay, okay, okay. I gotta see that cutting him card. I really do. Cause I agree with you. He might be tough. Ah, oh, god damn it, man! Fuck. Yo, he bumped this shit out that dude for an hour. I mean, well, Vic, it's not like Vic doesn't have Eagles chem, though. That's what y'all got to like. I don't understand why we not understand them. What's his other defense? Chat, seriously, if it's not 3-4 blitz, everybody, what is it? Cover 3 stock. Mm-hmm. 
Civil Party. I, if I had to make Civil Party, I had to make all his boys, all them TNC, all them little nerd frat boys. Shit, I respect you. I respect them. I respect them. Come on, Valdez. Tough catch, but you can make it. Tough catch, but he can make that. I mean, I only have nine points, man. This is brutal right now. <sighs> Just like, I, I mean, he literally is absolutely clueless on how to play the game on defense. Absolutely clueless on how to play Madden. And I, it's only nine. I'm one run away from being in a hell game. One run away from being in a hell game. Like, look at this nerd. Nah, sports fan. Nah, he's playing decent. He's playing decent inside the 10. Really? That time, it hurt me because I didn't have... Um, I'm playing this run super safe here, boys. Lynn ball. Call timeout. Hope to break a run. Leaf, what up? This guy is nine and one, chat. I mean, just run the ball, man. Is there a different run that's going to work better against three deep? Like, do you need to do that motion against three deep? Is that the important part of the play? Scrub. And now it looks, it's going to look like he had good... It's going to look like he had a good rushing game. God, man. You guys think I'm kidding, man. You take the running plays out of Madden, this game, this game has an immense skill gap. I'm just mad that it's going to look like he didn't get boxed running the ball. Oh, I wanted to kill him with Roquan. Gun doubles weak. This is 1,000% going to be a run. I'm listening to the YouTube right now. Don't come out and run. Don't come out and, and pass defense or run defense. Oh, a fucking RPO. How nice, dude. What, what, a, what a mix up. What a mix up I wasn't ready for. An RPO. Oh, Nelly. Oh, Nelly. Scrub, dude. Christian Wilkins. Uh, 
Let's go, Roquan. Eat, kid. Eat, kid. D-Lo, what's up, buddy? How you, man? Let's go, man. Golly, this is bad. Like, the box score are going to look just in them two runs before the half when I was playing safe. The box score are going to look respectable. I mean, this, I just wish I had points, man. This game is so over if I had points. Like, this game is so over if I had points. I mean, it's over. Like, chat, it's over. But it's like, it's like so over if I had points. Like, it's so over if I had points. Like, now we're back right where we were, bro. <sighs> Stock cover three, man. I, I really don't even need to score a touchdown, honestly, Chet. I really have no need to score a touchdown right now. Yeah, I was watching the Bulls game. I'll kick another one. Literally, just to, just on the six yard line. Just cannot punch the ball in. You need to run. You're right. I need to get a running back and run. But it's not that serious, man. It's really not. Literally, I can win. I win on just on field goals, chat. Problem is, I'm not gonna pad my stats. What do you mean, Walking? What did you want? You wanted me to be in the chat? I was chilling. I was watching. Trust me, I was watching. I ran it. I mean, my little quarterback blast ain't really working like I wanted to. Like, bro, give this shit up. Like, just give it up, man. Yeah, well, I can for sure. Clef lost. I was sick. I can't lie. I was King, my guy, man. Good run, man. We're gonna work on we gonna work on that defense though, man. We gonna King, we gonna work on that defense, man. Cause you had some high power shit that that looking high power that wasn't even close to high powered, like. I mean, there's six people every time he runs the ball. I can see him running sweep right here. Yep. 
Yep, that's Miles Jack, boys. That's why we draft him. I mean, this is just brutal. Like, this is like, this is the Stone Age offense right here. Like, how do you go into a game like this? Stop the running back route. 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 Sundown five, man. You are absolutely clueless. Absolute, like absolutely clueless. I mean, if I could just score down here, like this is rough, chat. Like, these kids are just, just, I need to get better dots down here. I need to do a little running back route my damn self. Let me try a still skin bowls play down here. No, Dobby, you don't do that. This is just brutal, chat. This is just absolutely brutal that I can't score on this idiot. Just cannot score down here, man. Oh my god, just can't. I saw what I needed, though. I don't need it. Like, I, I saw what I needed, though. Oh my god. Just can't I just I just can't score down there, dude. Oh my god, it's like this game should be 35 to 0. He can't get he can't get a yard. 35 to 0 should be the score of this game, man. Strong tight. Strong wing. F7. Strong wing, strong I, strong wing, strong F, I, H. Had the balls to kick. No, I don't need it. What do I need to kick for, man? This guy can't score. I could punt. I could punt. Strong side, left side, strong side. If he runs again, bro, like you really can't run again. Like, Slice bread, at least I got to see the field. You, I can run the same play, but I got to see the field. You know what I'm saying? I got to make the adjustments. I got to put the right routes on the field. Have to make a read. Have to climb the pocket. Here we go. Offset tight end. Here we go. Gun tight, offset tight. I don't know what this is. Is this all tight offset? Is that what we're doing right now? Okay. You know what that means. Inside zone, boys. Inside zone. Yep. Motion them over. Run inside zone. Yep. Yep. 
This is so goddamn no huddle. I mean, and I go off. I hate this. Dude, dude, this kid is such a like an absolute scrub. Absolute scrub. He should just let somebody else run the CF, or he should just run the CFM and let somebody else play. He's gonna run stretch. 1,000% he's gonna run stretch here and pray and pray that they get the yards. It's just a prayer. Oh, he actually passed? Oh, shit. Look at a fucking screen pass. A snap screen pass to Breda. Bro. This dude is terrible. Like, he don't give up. He trying every run he got in his custom playbook. Nope. Roquan. Roquan. That's why we got Roquan and Miles Jack in the middle. They're making plays, man. Single back wing slot. I don't even know what this is. RPO action. Yep. Stretch RPO. Come on. Just run the stretch RPO, man. It's four minutes left in the game. Yep. We're manned up and everything. Come on. This is fucking unreal. This is unreal, this game, man. Unreal. Gun tray flex. Here we go, man. Inside zone. 1,000% right here, boys. Fuck, man. God damn, man. He's just no fucking huddling this garbage, man. Like, there's no way you can be this bad at passing the ball. Like, there's just no way you can be this damn garbage at the game, man. Just no huddles it. Oh, yeah. Fourth down. No huddle again. Come on. Run inside zone again. This is brutal. This is actually brutal. Actually brutal. Actually brutal. Single back, wing flex, close. Stretch. All me! All me, dickhead! Terrible, man. I need to get a touchdown. Here we go, back to 3-4, man. The brain dead. See ya! Wouldn't want to be ya! time we got some points up here chat oh we can flood seattle this week by the way is any 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 eagles fans in the chat or youtube we are having a thousand dollar man tournament at the eagles tailgate if you're there if you want to be there come by check it out kick it with me drink tailgate for the eagles game man D definitely right here we're going to get some i form tight h yep
This is absolutely brutal, dude. Like, this is absolutely brutal. What? How, how long has man been out, chat? How long has man been out? Seriously. Two months? Three months? I'm fine with running the ball, man. I really have no... That, I mean, it is what it is. People want to come out here and establish the run. But when you see you're running into a brick wall, how do you not have anything else to go to? Like, you don't have one pass play that you like. Did we just get burnt, dude? Ooh, this guy is such a fucking bad dude. Like, you don't have anything else to go to. Like, there's really nothing else in a playbook. It's a CFM. You have a custom playbook. I really thought he might be on an out route or something. Like, this, I'm, I'm just, I'm appalled at how bad this is. Like, this is making me actually sick as a human being with eyes and a brain. It really is. It really, it's really, like, it's making me sick. It's making me sick that there's another human being that can play this game like this. Man up the running back. That's all you got to do, man. Oh, my God, dude. Like, you, this this can't be, just, like, this isn't real life. And we're calling timeout. This guy, dude, I'm, like, I'm appalled that there's somebody else, like, that there's somebody that has this video game and plays like this. Like, at, like, 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 it's not like some guys in salary cap, if you guys, I mean, obviously you guys watch the salary cap. But how do you, like, uh, you know what I'm saying, chat? Am I tripping when I say, how do you not have anything else to go to? That's all I'm, that's all that'd be surprising me. Like, how don't you have, like, an like, another option, essentially? You know what I mean? Like, if shit gets bad, how do you not have something else to go to? It's not like you don't have any. Like, sometimes those guys that just run will have, like. Oh, Lord, that was just Stanley Steamer, dude. Like, sometimes those dudes will have, um... They, know, they won't have a quarterback, or they, their wide receivers will be ass. This is CFM, bro. You can have any player you want. You can have any player... You know, he has enough players and stuff. Like, to really have no... To have no other... Like, no plan B? It's nuts. But we won that game. Shut out, man. No, nah, he's not that type. No, nah, he's he, he a great owner. He the man. But it's just like, how do you not have, like, a plan B? Like, I'm mad that he actually scored uh, points. Or he actually, not that he scored points, but he, um, the rushing yards at, look, one for six. What was his long at the end? 23 yards. Take that 23 yards out. He's less than, he he's as low as at this as yards per carry. 1.6 for that guy, 2.5 for that guy. That's run defense, man. And that's why I built my team. This is what one thing I love to see the CFM, man. I built my team with fat guys. That's why I traded for Linval. I have Christian Wilkins. I have the four goon linebackers that I drafted probably in the top six picks. Uh, Daniil Hunter, TJ Watt, obviously the super goons. But then I got Miles Jack and I got Roquan Smith on the inside linebackers. Like my secondary really wasn't going to tackle him. But as long as we have bodies around the ball, like my middle linebackers dominated that game. My outside linebackers dominated that game. Just really built my team the right way. And I think that Linval trade, not that he made crazy plays right there, but I, as we see Ronnie Harrison, not that he made crazy plays, but um, he just clogged up the middle a little bit, man. And one thing about the Linval trade, it allowed me to move Christian Wilkins to outside defensive end. So that even made my 3-4 even more potent. Although Marcus Hunt, Marcus Hunt made pretty much the most, as I'm going to use slot on DJ Shark. I want some more short route running and things like that. Yeah, plus three short, plus one speed on Shark. We got a plus one speed on DJ Shark. 
that gets him the 95 speed. So right now we have a 95 speed and shark 90. Not, like my wide receivers are just dumb right now. I'm telling you, I want my zone on. I want zone to get 80, 80 zone or Blair to get 80 zone. Plus two zone covers. I think that might be an 85 zone. Yeah, it's 85 zone. If anyway, I can get Blair to 90 zone. Wish I could to play rack up a little bit, but that that guy's young. Lonnie, the same thing. Zone. I just want zone on my safeties. Plus speed on Lonnie Ballantyne and tackle, bro. I'm getting glitched right now with my uh, 94 speed on Lonnie Ballantyne, man. That's huge. Man, I'm picking the right the right adjustments. All right, uh, here we go with my man. Matt Tanner looks just like me, literally just like me. Bald, beard, white, fat, me. It's my guy. That's why he starts. I saw all the championship games, but now we look at my team as we're 11 and 2. 11, I mean 11 and 0. We are 11 and 0. Lead the NFL, NFC. Every other team has two losses. Should get home field throughout. Um, I am. I got a good point differential. I think I got a good point differential. Probably had a lot of games forced win where I didn't play them. Um, let's take a look at the adjust. The, just the, the just. Like my, I'm telling you, man, these guys are not gonna want to keep playing the CFM because my team is deck. I had made this team. Like in YouTube, you guys gotta give me credit. If you haven't watched the draft, you can go back and look at the draft. It's probably like 30 videos back. But obviously, Big Strap Jackson, probably in like the fifth, sixth round. I don't have a running back. I don't really run. But these wide receivers right now, 95 speed, 95 speed, 96 speed, Rashad Perriman, with that post flag elite, and of course, Julio Jones, who we we broke his, by changing positions, we broke his chemistry, so he either has wrecking ball if he ever gets it. But uh, Julio Jones is is essentially my worst receiver right now. Which is pretty nuts when you think about it. Uh, that game went by so fast. This is probably my shortest CFM video. Uh, just, just these wide receivers. Are, just these wide receivers are hell. 96 speed, 95 speed, 95 speed. Uh, tight. I don't use a tight end. My left tackle's good. My, my interior of my line is my weakest point. It's going to come back to bite me. I'm going to have to fight in the playoffs. Got to shore up that scoring inside the five-yard line, man. Uh... Definitely made that game closer than it needed to be. Like I said, Daniil Hunter is 97 overall now. As you see right, he got 88 block shed, 98 finesse move, superstar, double traits. We got TJ Watt. This is pretty much the same exact player with the 99 finesse, 93 block shed. So TJ Watt and Daniil Hunter on the edge are absolutely crazy. D tackle, like I said, we got Christian Wilkins, the young, the young, the young buck here. Got him with 96 block shed, man. He's got the 89 strength. Just a goon. 82 power move. He's not really a pass rusher, but he makes plays because of those two guys on the outside. Linval Joseph, that's the trade we made. That 97 strength, 91 block shed. You guys know Linval Joseph. You guys know he's been a goon in Madden pretty much since he's been in the game. So those are my two guys in the middle. Was using Marcus Hunt in my other defensive end spot. 84 speed. Just he got block shed. Just a big body, pretty much. Just big bodies, and that helps out. Left, I don't use them. These are my two middle linebackers, man. Roquan Smith, Miles Jack. Abs they were probably, they were two of my top five picks, honestly, for real. Uh, 89 speed, 88 speed, tackle, hit power, just absolutely dogs. I want to get these guys better, though, because I, I want one of these guys to get abilities, whether it's secure tackler, whether it's enforcer, whatever it may be. I want these two dudes to just really keep geeking. And then, then uh, these dudes don't play. But in the secondary, man, we got Rashad Melvin, 90 speed. Honestly, would like to see, would like an improvement there, but he's really solid. You know, nothing good. He's not good, but he's got good height. Uh, 90 speed is good enough. Uh, but Chris Westry, 95 speed, 6'4". It's my other corner. Got the goons. This is who I drafted. I pick up Westry in free agency. Then we go to the safeties. Lonnie Ballantyne got to 94 speed now. I mean, that's just a goon. Blair is my other safety with 20, 23 years old. 90 speed, 6'1". Just really tall. I got red wine, too. Got the rookie, Jamison Johnson. But looking back, I probably should have had an offensive lineman. But just really goons. He's got 91 speed. All these dudes can hit. But honestly, I feel like this about the game chat. You guys can tell me, like, bro, if you don't have Enforcer, you might as well not. Then my secondary is makeshift. 
But they got, you know what I'm saying, Skeeper? My secondary is makeshift. But they got good size, pause, and they got good speed. So it's like you could, they're, they're all projects. You know what I'm saying? And we got rap to bring it back. And then we got Ronnie Harrison, who's slow, but he got the best ratings on my secondary, really. So I'm liking the team. I'm liking where we're at. Lonnie getting a point of speed, getting up to 94 speed. I drafted Lonnie at 92 speed, so getting him that fast is, I, I mean, I'm really happy with this team right now. Can't I can't even complain. There's nothing really to complain about as we look at the roster overall. My not these are probably like my top five picks. Really. You see? Paraman is pretty much one of the, the breakout guys for me that really went off. But the, as we started, like I said, Valdez Scantling, he 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 started with ninety three speed. Shark, I believe, was ninety four speed, and Paraman was ninety five speed. So they all improved in their speed. They're all super young, man. And Julio is somewhere where I could really look to trade and even play this guy, Keelan Cole, or get somebody in a draft. I don't know if anybody would want Julio. Julio's so solid, though. You saw he ate that game. He ate on the in their immediate routes, then whip routes, zig routes, as you see. Short route running is a 98. Just absolute goon. But this was week, um, what week was this? Week 11. Or week, yeah, this week 11. We're 10 0. I think, are we 11? We're 11 0. Maybe that was week 12. All right, listen. Week 12, yep, 11-0. Next week, I play T. Davis. After that, I play the Rams, who I believe is somebody decent. The Redskins is decent, and the Cardinals, I forget who the Cardinals, I don't know who the Cardinals is. But I play T. Davis next week, rematch of the NFC Championship game, so make you make sure you guys tune in for that.